Hello and welcome back to the second video in Veerwand's Road to Glory. Since the last time a lot of things have changed so I'm gonna quickly get you up to speed with how the team looks now and uh, what we've been doing. So I did an icon moments pick which is very dumb and I got this so I picked Pirlo but that wasn't the only Italian thing that happened. I also packed a uh, foot captain Quayarella and he's kinda good, let's see. So Coyarella will definitely be in the team. I opened this pack. I was hoping maybe to get a fun super sub of a starter. I get someone Dutch, center forward, so it's Memphis a pie. He definitely will be a super sub for this team. I did another icon moments pick, which is very, very dumb. I was hoping for a Dutch player. I don't get it. I'm gonna pick Yashin because he's pretty good on my other account, so why not? So this is how the team looks now. Yes, I bought Kluivert just because I thought he would fit the team. I was thinking about getting Seedorf as a left winger, but I don't really have the money for it. This is my bench, Orban, very good at heading, Coyarella, of course, a beast, and the pie. So this is how the team looks for Weekend League, so let's play. I did manage to get Seedorf because I got very lucky in my uh, packs from Marky matchups. He looks to be a very good player, so I'm definitely going to use him. This is my first opponent and in Weekend League it's always like your first opponent is either very bad or very good and he was very good. I go 1-0 down but that happens a lot so I don't really care. Kluivert finds a Veerman and I do the wrong shot but thank god Gelson Martins is there with the cheeky chip to make it 1-1. I don't really get to enjoy the draw for very long because uh, Pelé makes a goal. So we're 2-1 down but just after the half Gravenberg finds Veerman. Not a header, but a good volley, and it's 2-2, so uh, great stuff. I then changed my team around a bit, tried, uh, played with two strikers, and he immediately scores a goal, so I'm a very good coach. That was all the game I had to offer, so we lose our first weekend league game 3-2. Veerman got a goal, but uh, I still needed to play a bit more with this team to get a feeling for it. But let's play the second game. Game number two will be against a tree back, which is a very easy to play through. Kluivert finds Pirlo and that's 1-0 after just 7 minutes. A pretty good start for me. Gravenberg finds Veerman. Heads it in. I can see that my opponent presses pause so I know what's going to happen. I celebrate with Veerman. This was the knockout blow for my opponent. We win. Easy game, easy life, uh, very early rage quit, so let's play the third game. We played against a three back, now we play against a five back, pretty good team. Gravenberg finds Veerman, who gets involved in the play a lot. Kluivert gives the ball back to Veerman, and that's a very good goal. So we're 1-0 up. Pirlo finds Martins, and he's just way too quick for any of his defenders. Good goal, and we're 2-0 up. We don't stop. Kluivert, a bit lucky, but gets the ball to Seedorf. And now Veerman is doing trick shots, so it's 3-0. And that's all this game had to offer. My opponent stopped playing very seriously, so I did the same. So just an easy win, 3-0, Veerman, two goals. But let's play another game. Next game, again a 3-back, but a way, way better team. Like very, very good players. Veerman finds Kluivert to Gelson Martins, and that's 1-0. So as you can see, I don't just pass the ball to Veerman. Good football from him will lead to an Mbappe goal, so 1-1. Second half, Gravenberg reaches the back line. Guess who's there? It's Gelson Martins again. So it's 2-1. And now Veerman is going to show his playmaking ability. Gets the ball from Bale. Waits, perfect pass to Memphis, who makes it 3-1. And these two are really a great combination. Veerman finds Bale out on the flank. Back to Veerman. To Memphis, and that's again a goal. So 4 1 for me, and my opponent leaves. So Veerman didn't score a goal, but he had two assists. So very, very good from him. 
And the final game of this video will be against this team. Pretty solid looking team, but nothing too crazy. We get a corner kick, doesn't reach Veerman, reaches Gravenberg who heads it in. So we're 1-0 up, great stuff. Veerman finds Kluivert, good turn, very good shot, so 2-0 up. He'll get a goal back with Thierry Henry after some very poor defending from me. Veerman again to Kluivert, this is also a very good duo. So we're 3-1 up and then things go wrong very very quickly. He first does this corner kick which leads to a goal. So okay, very well played out and then just like minutes later it's 3-3. So uh, pretty bad for me. Then the best goal I've scored with Veerman, Pirlo. What an amazing goal from Henk Veerman. I tried doing it like every game because a uh, comment said that he scored like a bicycle kick with him. So I tried the same too. Not very good goalkeeping from Donnarumma, but still a very, very good goal. Kluivert finds a Veerman. My opponent went all out attack, which will leave a lot of room. I don't pass, I shoot and Veerman makes his second goal of the game. Martins finds a Gravenberg and that's 6-3 six, six and my opponent says well I had enough, I'm gone. So he rage quits, Veerman 2 goals, 2 assists, this man is an absolute beast. I'm very very happy that still that that guy commented that I should use him because he's very good, very fun to use. I'm using a very fun team now so I'm really enjoying playing FIFA even though it's August and uh, most of the most people have stopped playing this game. I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did leave a like subscribe if you're new and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!